Thank you, EA Sports FIFA. Thank you very, very, very much. They've finally released a Team of the Season upgrade now. With Team of the Season coming to a close, FIFAcoinzone.com are starting a brand new thing on their site where they're doing top series packs. Make sure you go check them out and use code HABER to get yourself 5% off. It's got requirements a little bit higher than I was expecting slash hoping for. This SPC is a little bit expensive and I was hoping it'd be a lot cheaper than this, maybe like an 83 or 84 rated squad. However, an 86 rated squad with the team of the season, I'm not a big fan of that EA. However, I'm a big fan of the repeatable tots upgrade and I will be grinding a lot of these out and I'm down to open a bunch of these packs now. I've built one straight away because we're just going to open up and see what we get in our first one. Just to see what it's like. And then I'm going to open up a bunch more uh, and just see what they're like. Hopefully we can get some good. So you need a team of the season player, an 86 rated squad with 30 chemistry. I have done that. Now I'm submitting my flashback Vidal that I don't actually use. I'm using my Torres that I don't actually use and submitting the Stacey card that I don't uh, play with either. So uh, I decided to use these three cards and then just an 80, uh, 82 rated squad. Oh, with, with David Silver in there as well. Um, it pretty much just gets 86 rated and, and it just, that's pretty much it really i don't use torres i don't use vidal i don't use stacy so i thought might as well just throw those guys in so why not um so yeah let's jump into it and see what we can get in our in our first team of the season pack it's only major leagues as far as i'm aware it's a tots upgrade from only major leagues i just want to double check that real quick um exchange a squad for an ult oh, sorry untradeable team of season player from epl bundesliga la liga city R, or league un okay so um, yeah, that you can only get the top five leagues, which is a good thing. There are still a lot of players in there that fall under a pretty terrible category, but you do have a chance of getting someone a lot better than if it's just a normal, repeatable team in the season upgrade. So, first one, let's see what we can get. Come on, EA, let's see something decent in the first one. It's a walkout, good sign, good start. What is it going to be, EA? Come on. It's going to be... Oh, you... That is just terrible, man. For an 86 rated squad, you shouldn't be allowed to get a card like that. That that SBC, I think the base price on it on Footbin right now is about 140,000 coins. And that's just going to rock it upwards throughout the week. That's just ridiculous. That is ridiculous, EA. What are you doing? You can't give us cards like this for that much. It, that's like a third of the price of the card. Like, look, this card literally is a 30,000 coin card. For 140k. Brilliant. Okay, so George has been an absolute beast. And he's actually given 10 packs for us to open. He went and built them straight away. Now, let me just show you what he's done. He has completely gutted his club. He literally has nothing left apart from his team, Eusebio Sterling Lozano. And he really wants that Tots Mbappe and Tots Neymar, which would be phenomenal to pack for him. So. Hopefully, out of 10, we can get him at least something they could put in his team. That that The goal is something they could put in his team. Out of 10 of these tots packs, I just want one of the huge ones, EA. Please, show me a huge player. So, first one, here we go. Of course, we just got Kazri in my first one. So, hopefully, we get something a lot better than his. Now, I think all of these should be walkouts. I'm almost certain all of them should be walkouts. So, I'm not going to think much of it being a walkout. The first one is... Uh, is that Diagne? The Dijene, there you go, Dijene. I couldn't remember what the guy's name was. Now, as much as this card looks actually really, really good, um, dribbling and passing aren't that great. And he's like five foot nine, I think, or five foot six, five foot nine. So unfortunately, I just don't think that card will be that great in game. If he had amazing dribbling and passing, I could see why he'd be really, really attractable and really usable. However, five foot nine with poor dribbling and passing, not a big fan. Anyway, second team of the season pack. Come on, EA, please, please. Show me some good players here. I'd feel really bad if he gutted his entire club and didn't get anything good. Italian. Striker. Ooh. Quagliarella. Not too bad. I mean, we're getting to the decent ones. That's not too shabby. Um, no, still not amazing in my opinion. I've used this card and it's a, it's a decent card in game. But I don't think it's that great. Like, it, it's nice. A nice great card's nice. But you really want elite, out of 10, you want one elite tier team of the season. Like, you want one of, like, the Mbappe or the Havertz, someone like that, really. Um, so, that's what we're hoping for, really. That's what that's what the end goal is. That's what the end game is. That's what we want. So, third one now. Come on, EA, please. Italian again, right mid this time. See, that's just not good. That's not good enough. That's not good enough. This is why I feel like the SBC should have been 83 or 84 rated. Because you're going to get majority of these packs. They're going to have that in. Majority of them. The EA aren't going to give back with these packs. Because they never do. 
They never really do. I mean, I'm don't get me wrong. The the inner child in me is very excited about the SBC, right? You know, I really enjoy opening them. But you, most of these packs are going to be the, the lower end team of the seasons. I just, th I just think it's too expensive. I just think it's too expensive and don't think it's that worth it. However, that being said, if you do choose to open them, I'd love to hear who you get down below. Uh, as we get ourselves a Holstenberg, which again, like, it's a nice looking card, but it just doesn't go for anything. I mean, obviously, you're, you're not looking to sell these players on, but it's just... It's not a good enough addition to someone's squad for 130,000 coins, in my opinion. When, for that amount of coins, you could actually do a decent SBC or a chunk of an SBC. Or you can go out and buy someone better, you know? Or someone that's better suited to a team, in my opinion. That's just the way I see it. Especially when there's a 92-rated Mendy in uh, the objectives right now. Which is actually a really, really good card in game. So, that's how I feel about it. Anyway, fifth one now. Fifth one. Come on, EA. Show us someone good, please. Show us something decent. Come on. Banish. Centre mid. I mean, Santi Cazorla. Again, a cool looking card. Not really usable. I think his stamina lets him down at this point in FIFA, to be honest. I think his stamina massively, massively lets him down at this point in FIFA. 74 stamina. Just isn't good enough, sadly. I mean, he would be an incredible cam otherwise. But sadly, he's not. That's just a little bit disappointing. But we've reached a halfway point without an elite tier team of the season yet. The best one we've had so far is Quagliarella. So, can we get someone else decent? Come on, EA, please. Come on. I really hope we can. I really hope we can. Please, German. Right wing back. De Costa's decent again. Don't know if he's already got De Costa or not. De Costa's good, but I'm pretty sure he's got Walker, who's better. So... Or in my opinion, I think Walker is a bit better. The reason I think Walker is better is because I think that Walker, not only is it easier to fit Walker in a squad, which I would rate higher than DaCosta, um, but I just think he's got better all-round in-game stats for DaCosta. Like, DaCosta is a, a big brute, and he's incredible on the ball and stuff like that, uh, and he's, like, really strong. But I don't know. I think Walker is probably a little bit better on the ball and probably a bit better going forward, too. Uh, anyway, we've got four packs left. I just hope we can get one Sick, Paul. Yeah, show me a good nation, please. Show me Portugal. Just show me Portugal. Show me Portugal. It's going to be... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yay. EA, man. It's just not good. It's just not good enough. It's just not good enough. Come on. EA, rel relinquish the requirements. Lower the requirements down to an 83-rated squad for this. Like, this is just awful. Like, the SBC right now is is nearing 200,000 coins per pack. Why? Why Why? Why can you pack such low-rated cards for 200,000 coins? It doesn't make it worth it. Brazilian. Goalkeeper. Allison. 95. I mean, like, come on. Come on. That's the first good nation we've had so far, but come on. Come on, EA. Come on. EA. I'm actually like, this is hurting a little bit, man. This is hurting a little bit. This is a little bit painful. We've got two more left. Just, let's just see what... Come on, redeem it. If we get like a million coin card, then it redeems it, right? In my opinion. If we get like a, a two million plus card, then it's worth it. Like, come on. It's going to be French. Left back. Mendy. I mean, that's not bad at all, actually. That's a good card. That's a, that's a, that's, that's a very good card. That's an end game card. We've had, we've had a couple of like cards that could be end game but it's like no one elite tier like that's a good card that that card is definitely usable i i actually have used this card a lot and i'm a big fan of it uh it's just not an elite tier card come on last one e8 come on e8 please end it on a bang can we end it on someone big please come on e8 please don't make this worthless it's gonna be spanish center mid it's a duplicate sandy cazola just what you want to see just what you want to see Brilliant. All right. Well, George had just said that he should be able to get five more done. So I'll leave George to it. We'll be back in just a second. All right. So George has built four more TOTS packs, which takes us up to 15. Uh, he insisted on using those terrible team of the seasons that we packed him to get him four more TOTS packs done. So hopefully we can end off with a good team of the season, EA. Please, man. Please end it with a good team of the season. Don't end it with the best player being Quagliarella. Come on, Italian, right mid. Why on earth are you back? Like, who invited you back? 
Out of anything, who invited you back? Nobody did. Nobody wanted you. I think you're the worst player that you could possibly get. Please, just leave everyone alone. Leave me and my family alone. Just leave me alone, please. Oh, my word, EA. Come on. All right, second team of the season pack. Please, show me something decent. Just show me a big flag. Show me something, like, show me French, please. Come on. Spanish. Great. You already know it's not going to be good. It's PK. I mean, it's just not great, is it? 96 is, you know, it's a good rating, but it's just not great, sadly. I'm just not that happy with that, sadly. Disappointing. Disappointing. We'll store it anyway. I don't think you make money on that one. Right, two more. I think, in terms of plays we've had back, Quagliarella and Mendy are the only two we've probably made profit on. I think, like, and I say profit lightly. I don't know. I don't know about Quagliarella. And Mendy for sure, but I don't know about Quagliarella. You know? Right, next one's going to be... Ooh. Oh, I thought that was Ivory Coast. I got my flags mixed up. It's going to be Matt Doherty. I thought that was going to be Nicholas Pepe, which would have been sick. That would have been a huge card. But unfortunately, I got my flags mixed up. You know, just stay away from this SBC. <laughs> I don't know about this one. All right, last one. Last but not least to make a 15 rounded off. Come on, EA. Show me something good. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. And we end it on that, sadly. And we end it on Caustic. That is a little bit disappointing. Um, let me know what you guys get in these SPCs and how many you've done. It's just it's not good enough, sadly. It's just not great. All right, I've done one more on my account because I just wanted to do one more. Uh, I just wanted to, to end it off on one more pack because, I don't know, I, I, like that can't be it. That can't be it, EA. Come on, surely that can't be it. Anyway, let's see what we can get in this last one. Please, EA. I just want one elite team of the season. One elite team of the season. Come on, what are we going to get? What are we going to get? It's going to be... Damn it, man. Another caustic. It's just not good. It's just not good value for money, SBC. I would steer well clear if I were you. This SBC is not good value for money. It is not worth it. It's just not good value for money. But if you guys enjoyed this video, leave a like down below. God, that team just looks so good. That team is just so nice to look at, man. If you guys enjoyed, leave a like down below. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are on around here. If you want my advice, if you've got a ton of players and coins in the club and you want to have a bit of fun, then give it a go. If not, I'd stick to grinding towards the weekly objective players and stuff like that because I'll be honest with you, it's just not productive to do this SPC. It just hasn't been worth it in my opinion. But thank you all for the support. I really appreciate it. You guys are absolute legends. You guys, you just support me every day and I'm very grateful. We're almost at 89,000 subscribers. So I'm very grateful and I'll see you later.